Hi, I'm Dr. Kodladi Surinder Shetty. I'm a consultant spine surgeon at Spine Care and Ortho Care Hospital, Magdi Road, Rajajinagar, Bangalore. In cervical spine, we have physiological lordosis. Lordosis in the sense there is a bend in the cervical spine with its convexity forward. So, as you know, the bone is forward and behind that is the spinal cord. So, when there is a convex or the normal lordotic curve, the cord will remain slightly away from the bone. So, that means there is a physiologically, there is some gap between the bone or the disc and the spinal cord. So, even if there is a small disc bulge there, it does not press upon the cord. So, it is not painful. But on the other hand, this normal lordosis changes into kyphosis, abnormal kyphosis. Kyphosis means concavity forwards, bending forward like this. When it is bent forward, the spinal cord slips over that. It straps over the back of the bone. So then what happens? Even a small disc can press upon the cord and produce more symptoms. So that is why cervical kyphosis is much more dangerous than the lumbar or thoracic. Thoracic, we have a normal physiological kyphotic curve. In lumbar, we have a lordotic curve. But even in the lumbar kyphosis, it doesn't give that much of problem because there we have narrow roots rather than spinal cord. But in the cervical region, we have spinal cord and even a small disc in a kyphotic cervical spine can produce more pressure, more pain and more symptoms and more problems.